This video is on how to install the correct drivers for the TV card if the wrong ones are currently installed. Now I'm going to do a quick review here. This video card is the Easy TV card. It's the only one with two plugs. Um, the next one is the original uh, Sabrent TV card. It has one plug but all black ones for the audio. And the last one is the new Sabrent TV card that has one plug but then also then it has colored cards there and we're gonna look at uh, the computer that I'm on right now and we're gonna uh, assume uh, that it actually has this card when we looked at it this is a Sabrent original card uh, but it doesn't have the right drivers installed so to get to the device manager I'm gonna go start I'm gonna go to my computer and right click on it then I go to manage. So I, my, I right click on my computer, go to manage, and we'll get the computer management panel popping up. And then I'm going to go to the device manager. Now, uh, the next thing you're going to do is go down to sound and video game controllers and double click on that so it opens up. And we can see that the drivers that are installed right now are for the SAA 7130, which are the drivers for this card. But we're going to say we need to force it to go to this card because this is the card that actually that we see in the back of our PC when we're looking at the back. So I've got the wrong driver. So the first thing I'm going to do is get rid of the wrong driver. So I'm just going to click, highlight the video capture one, hit delete, and say OK. And when I get rid of that, if I look down there again, you see that both of them disappeared by getting rid of the capture. Then I'm going to go up top, right click on the computer name and say scan, and it's going to immediately find new hardware stuff, and it's automatically installing the wrong one for me. So that's not what I really want to do. Look down there, and there they are again. Oh, there we go. That's what I wanted to happen. I did not. <laughs> I wanted it to come and say it found the new hardware wizard. Okay, so found new hardware. I'm going to say yes that um, I want to install it and I'm gonna go next and then it thinks that's what it is but we're gonna tell it to install a different one so we're gonna say we want to install from a specific location and say next and we want to say don't search I'll tell you which driver okay now this process is the same no matter which TV card we've got in there so far okay I delete the bad ones say scan and it's gonna pop up I'm gonna say don't search next and then all the drivers are in the same place. I'm going to say have disk, and I'm going to say browse, and I'm browsing to my C drive, and in particular, I'm driving, browsing to my C drive into this folder that says TV Tuner, and every single teacher has that folder called TV Tuner. And when I open up this one, I see that there are folders for three different cards, okay? The Easy TV card drivers are in there. The original Sabrent TV card are in there. The one that says uh, just TV card WMD. And the newest one that say SAA 7130 are in, I'm sorry, this is the WMD one. This where it says new one is the one for the 7130. So if I want to install the one for, I'm going to put this on the side and bring it up. Okay, so this card again with two plugs, the Easy TV card, I'm going to use the drivers in here. This card with the colored plugs is the new Sabrent card. Those drivers are in there. And this one that has the black plugs on it and one plug are in the original TV card. Okay, just so we've got it straight which ones we're looking at. So I'm doing the original TV card one. So I'm going to look in this folder. I'm going to double click on that folder. Then I see I've got applications, I've got drivers, I'm doing drivers, so I'm going to double click on that one. And I've got two, I've got capture drivers and TV tuner. It always, in all three cases of every card, it does the capture drivers first and then the TV tuner. So I'm going to say, hey, use this driver right here. It just put all that stuff in there. I say, okay. Then it says, hey, I just found these two drivers in that location. I'm doing the capture drivers first. I go next, and it always says this, hey, I don't think this is the right one. If you verify that you got the right ones, 
you've looked at the back of the card, you know which one goes with which because you're watching this video, then just say yes. Okay, and the next thing it's going to do is install the drivers. It's going to find the TV tuner next. You're going to go through the exact same process and then pick the TV capture card WDM TV tuner. Again, the WDM goes with this one, the 7130 goes with this one, the Easy TV card goes with that one. Folders look a little bit different for the different ones. I'm going to look, we just looked at the Sabrent TV card, the original folders. It just has a driver file. The one that says new card is a little different. When you click into that one, then you have to go to the TV card again here. Then you see the drivers there and you go into the drivers. And then again, it'll only show you two. It's going to show the tuner and it's going to show the TV capture drivers. If we were to look in the one for the easy TV card, you don't have a driver folder, it has a utility folder. And then inside the utility folder, it has a DRV folder. This DRV folder has the, the um, drivers in it. Again, it will just find the right one. You've got the capture file and the tuner file. You always do the capture file first for whichever video card, because it always finds that one first, and then you do the tuner file. Uh, and that's the introduction to how to install the drivers for the TV card. I want uh, everybody to try this, and if you need help, obviously give me a call and I'll come down and help you.